proof that together we can make a difference. We have some good news to report on USCIS's adjudications of deferred action petitions. Yesterday, September 19th, 2019, the House Oversight and Reform Committee announced that the Department of Homeland Security had alerted its members that USCIS would resume the acceptance and adjudication of non-military deferred action requests. Last month, without notice, USCIS began issuing denial notices for these requests, eventually confirming that it had, as of August 7th, 2019, decided to stop accepting and adjudicating all non-military requests made at local USCIS field offices. The DHS decision to resume accepting deferred action requests came after a concerted effort from AILA and our coalition partners in the immigration and healthcare communities, as well as leaders in Congress who provided critical oversight of the change in policy and the manner in which it was enacted. AILA proudly recognizes its members who played a significant role in shedding important light on this issue, taking action by encouraging members of Congress to hold USCIS accountable, and sharing stories of the impact on their clients with members of Congress and the media. Our collective efforts have been crucial to the reversal of this policy and to securing a critical victory for vulnerable individuals and their families. While this is cause for celebration, there is still work to be done. AILA remains committed to monitoring the re-implementation of this policy and ensuring that USCIS fully reverses course and continues, as before, accepting and adjudicating these requests based on the processes in place before the August 7th change.